so welcome or welcome back to my channel my name is violet and i'm vlogging a college week in my life today was honestly super productive i like last week i worked out and um like went to spin classes in the evening i look like the morning we'll see how long my energy lasts but i drink a celsius and then a panera red charge lemonade so definitely consumed too much caffeine today but <sighs> It was productive, went to spin class, and then I just helped out a little bit afterwards, and then I went to pick up some groceries, quickly got ready, and now I'm going to head out. I think I'm gonna go to 1922 by Carolina Coffee Shop to get some work done, because I pretty much honestly wanna finish all my work for the week today, so I don't have the stress of the week. That's something I wanna like do this semester, so we'll see if that happens. But I'm for the most part ready, just doing a quick outfit, all black. So go to I need to I have a lot I could buy things and have a lot of color but it's a go to a staple. I'm gonna show you guys what I got from the grocery store and like unpack everything and stuff. So yeah. So here's everything that I bought. So from Whole Foods I just bought two of these because I don't really feel like going back every single week. These are my favorite snacks ever. And then I've had the siete um my tortilla chips before, but I haven't had the nacho flavor, so I really wanted to try it because like yesterday I was craving Doritos so badly. And then I just got some shredded cheese that I can use for breakfast but it's like multi-purposeful some sweet potato fries and then also bought three bags of that which is my favorite vegetable ever and then just some chicken meatballs for later so some protein for a meal this week and then just some eggs I got a brown ones but they're like 20 cents cheaper but like I think an eggs an egg some baby carrots these are a really like easy snack and they actually taste good they didn't have watermelon, so I just got this like fresh cut fruit medley. And then got some more bananas. This is my last one. And then I just got some bacon, some mint tea. Got some slums are my favorite trick for snacks. Plain bagels. And then just some beef and jerky. Y'all. I also like somewhat tidied up my room and made my bed. It looks really bad but it's better than what it looks like before i'm gonna just like putting my pillows in place like i just want to like make it look like something now just you know like growing up really like maturing growing up as well as the bananas aren't nasty you just like gotta give it a shot like i genuinely hated bananas I was like Ugh, ew i can only like a pipe but growing up for me is realizing the bananas are actually good. Hey you guys, so here is my final OOTD. This sweater is from Aerie. Underneath I'm wearing like this bralette type thing from Aerie. These flare leggings, which are like now one of my favorite things that I own. I'm so happy I got it in like long. Because it just like shoots down. Um from Offline by Airy. I'm just wearing these sneakers. These are my favorite sneakers to like walk in or work out in. So that's what we're gonna go with. I'm gonna throw a jacket on top. So I'm gonna head out now. And yeah. Okay, you guys, so I made it back to my room. It's currently 1.45. Let me sit down for this. <laughs> so essentially what had happened was I was going to go to a coffee shop. So no, 1922. First, first mistake was I literally <laughs> forgot to take the shortcut. There's a specific shortcut that I could take to get to Franklin Street like pretty easily. But my mind <laughs> didn't. Like, it just glitched a bit, and I, like, went down the wrong exit, I guess, or whatever. So I didn't take in the longer way there, which wasted time. So I go to 22, and I walk in, I'm like, it's packed like sardines. I'm like, you know, okay. Love that for this business, but, like, I need to see. So I ended up just getting coffee because 
with Pro Pure Bello. If you ride at the 7.30 class, you can get 15% off your coffee. And obviously I love supporting small businesses as well, just kind of supporting um, partnerships that Pure Bello has with other local businesses in Chapel Hill. So I went, got the coffee, it was actually pretty good. So then I walked to Panera Bread because I'm a Sip Club member. And I knew, because I remember one time or two times that I went there, they didn't really have outlets like that. So pretty much anywhere that did have an outlet was taken. So I ended up walking and then I tried figuring out like where else to go. Starbucks was obviously packed, um, but it also is a holiday as well. So like businesses hours are either like delayed and then like campus operations for the most part is like closed. So it was like pretty much a no go. So I was kind of annoyed, but it was what it was. So I ended up coming back to my apartment and then I just studied in one of our study lounges, which was actually pretty good. I've been there like a few times before, um, but I just wish that I wouldn't have wasted 45 minutes walking around and trying to find somewhere to study. But I want to make me a little lunch and then chill. I feel like I had too much caffeine today. Like I had a Celsius, I had a charged lemonade and then I had the coffee so my head like hurts now so I'm gonna eat see how I feel honestly if I want to take a nap I'm gonna allow myself to but uh, it feels good that I got work done so I'm gonna make me some lunch so here it is the price look he got stuck together but these are from Trader Joe's and these are like the air fried nuggets from I got it from Target it's like the Tyson brand or whatever so in order to go to a team meeting and then afterwards we are going to get K Chula, which is like a Mexican restaurant on Franklin Street. I actually really like K Chula a lot, so I'm excited. I've just been craving like tortilla chips and like queso and their salsa is really good. So let's do my thing here really, really quickly. But I'm really excited. This is the first team meeting that I've been to. Um in the first one of the year, so I'm really excited. Last semester, I was an ambassador. So like, I wouldn't, I wasn't like fully a part of the team, but I was kept in the loop, if that made any sense. But now that I am interning there and like helping out, you know, interning and helping out the studio and things like that like i feel, really feel like i'm a part of the team and it's been so much fun although i've been doing it for a week and a half it's been just such a good experience thus far everyone is so nice and helpful and it really just is a team and like how everyone just really works together and again like everyone's so nice like it's actually kind of crazy how nice people are obviously like i'm a nice person but like people are they're they're really really nice and really welcoming and it's just been a really great experience like i legit don't have any complaints so far and obviously i love spinning so and just a great environment overall like everyone's amazing so i'm getting ready to go to that today i don't know if i'm gonna wear a hat i don't know i don't know um, my skincare routine is really simple like I it doesn't take me that long so now let me just put my moisturizer on but yeah oh so after whatever I last filmed I pretty much just ate <laughs> and then I just watched some more make it or break it which is the show I'm watching right now like it's so nostalgic for me like I that's one of my favorite shows like ever because it just like i grew up wanting to be a gymnast not like realistically but like if like if my parents had the money and if i found out about it found out about it sooner something that i would have wanted to do but um i mean i don't really have any regrets from my childhood though but i don't even know if i would have wanted to train at that level as they are in the show <laughs> But that was fun and all. But I love that show. So I'm rewatching it. I rewatched it like two years ago, like my senior year of high school. In the fall, I'm rewatching it again. I feel like shows that I love, I just have to like rewatch it like 
every two or three years or so just to kind of keep it alive now um i did that now i'm gonna figure out what i'm gonna do with my hair again like i generally do not take long to get ready so i think i'm gonna leave it out i think i'm gonna leave it out oof just really just really perfect but so far honestly i feel like I'm just more optimistic about life. I'm definitely like in a better place mentally about everything because I was feeling overwhelmed. But once you kind of just get your life a little bit organized and then you actually start tackling some stuff and you start settling in and start building a routine again. And once you get off the period, things just start, things just start aligning perfectly. So, <laughs> so it's really exciting. I'm going to go. I'm just going to just one last touch. This is my favorite scent by far. I've been like a Sol de Janeiro stan for pretty much a year up to this point. Um, so I'm a real one. But um, when I chose to do my restock, I singled, like just zoned in on that scent. I used the body wash too. I only use the body wash like... If I'm going to class or a special occasion where like I want to smell extra good. But on a day to day, I use my method of wind down. That one's like the best because it just like helps me relax. Truly, the side is so good. Now I'm just going to put my every robot back together and then put my shoes on and head out. <laughs> hey, you guys, get unready with me. I'm back. I'm not gonna even lie, y'all. I need to go to sleep. Like, I'm tired. My brain hurts. It was the caffeine. I'm sorry. It's the caffeine. Um, because Celsius says 200 milligrams. I know that the Panera Bread charge whatever has over 200 as well. And then that coffee. So that's already over the limit. Like, <laughs> period. But, um, let's get ready for bed. I have class tomorrow because. On Tuesdays, I start at 9 a.m., but that class isn't meeting because it's a lab, and today we had off, so I guess in order for everyone to start at the same time, they're just going to push it back for us to all start the first week of lab next week, which I'm fine with. So I decided to sign up for a 7.30 spin class again today wasn't that bad to be honest it was actually pretty good um it was still actually pretty good i actually really had a good time i signed up because like i was an og like 7 30 like i was gonna be at 7 30 monday wednesday and friday like i was an og girl <laughs> let me stop but like i was like i was there like that was the time for the most part that I would go. Like I didn't really spend in the evening just because of my schedule and how things worked out. Cause like I would work. But now with my new internship that I'm starting, I have the flexibility of being able to go in the morning and the evening, which I signed up for two classes. So I'm, I don't know, I just like, it's a workout, but it's a party like, it really like, I don't even know how to describe it. Probably like, wow, well, you sound like really crazy right now. But it's true, like it may be a workout and it may be like a lot, but it really is just fun. You're just dancing out to the music. Hey, 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 hey. Like, <laughs> probably like, girl, go to sleep. Like your brain is fried right now. But yeah, so then we went to Kechula. Or why am I back here? So we had the team meeting. It was honestly really informative. Like I'm really happy because obviously like, I'm new. So like, you know, new. So I think it was really good for me to be able to just like learn more. I like how it's really also like collaborative and like really like a team. Like it's not just like the manager speaking, but it's also just everyone like contributing on how we can like grow as a team. So I loved that. And also just pointed out even just things in different ways that I want to like do better be better obviously it's like i've barely been working for two weeks 
I've only had like one full week, two days. So there's so much that I'm gonna continue to like learn and grow, but just even setting goals for myself and like how I wanna like do better and just be friendly and make an impact in any way that I can. Okay, I look crazy. Any hair, any hair. Don't mind me, but this is what I just do to kind of like stretch it out, just to kind of keep it at its length, I guess. But um, yeah, and then after the meeting, we went to Kechula. Honestly, it wasn't even that filling. I paid six dollars for the queso, and I didn't even finish it. I low key should have just packed it up, <laughs> but I wasn't really pressed. I don't really know what queso is really supposed to taste like, but I prefer Chipotle, is not gonna lie. Maybe like Chipotle, because also Chipotle was the first queso I've ever had, so maybe that's like what I consider a standard at this rate. But it was still pretty good though, and their chips are always bomb. The dot com. And then I got empanadas, which it looked so dumb because obviously like the presentation they were gonna give like lettuce, pico, guacamole, like, all that. I said scratch that. Just give me the empanadas. And it looked like girl, it was like an appetizer. Like what where was the meal? But I ate it. It was good and I just ate a lot of chips and queso. But okay, good morning you guys. So it's Tuesday. And I'm not ready for class. My camera like literally just died last night. But good morning. I went to spin, made breakfast, and then I got ready. And I have to leave in a bit, but I still have some time. My room was like an absolute tornado. And it's really annoying me. But yeah. Today's a bit gloomy and rainy, so I'm just doing they said they're not formally together but they're both from airy i don't know i have a love-hate relationship with these because they're low rise but i also love baggy sweats but they, they aren't that baggy also too i feel like with the top like if you're gonna wear baggy sweats the top either has to be tight or it has to match the level of bagginess so that's a dilemma that i found myself in today which i'm trying to figure out like what to wear but it's kind of gloomy and cold but I said so I think I'm gonna wear this. I don't know if I'm gonna put my puffer jacket on. I don't think so. I'm just gonna tough it out. Um, but yeah. You guys, so I'm getting ready to head out now. Just packed my backpack and everything, water, and then just two snacks. I have like two remote classes today. So pretty much I have like in-person remote, in-person remote. So I'll be alright. But final look and then I just Put on my platform converses and yeah let's just hope today's a good day i'm not gonna lie i'm very anxious because my first week wasn't traditional and i missed quite a few glasses <laughs> so i'm a little nervous just hoping that everything goes well but i'm sure that it will so i don't know if i'm gonna vlog i don't know if i'll keep it updated okay. but i'll try <laughs> Good morning, guys. I'm really sorry. Like, I just haven't been a good vlogger. <laughs> um, we're, I think I'll stop vlogging Tuesday because honestly, it's my first like full day of class. And when I got home, I had to quickly join my study group, and I was tired and I was hungry, so like, it just wasn't a vibe. It just wasn't the vibe. <laughs> but yeah, and then yesterday, I was just like living life. To be honest, I had my shift at Pure Velo. And then after that, I ate, took a nap. And then yesterday was my first day of my internship. I'm for the first two weeks, it's just gonna be like just basic stuff that I'm doing just because obviously like I'm new and like they were saying certain like accounts or campuses they're working on, like, you know, whatever. So where's my pick? Oh, so yeah. So, um, yeah, and then after 
my internship stuff i was just doing some homework and then i went to spin and then i went to kava with kendall um that was so good honestly i'm so glad i went to kava it was really good oh i forgot no i forgot because i bought like the side of pita chips and i forgot that i literally left one singular one and i brought it back with me i don't think i left took it out the car though but yeah today i just had a really slow morning i woke up around like 8 30 which felt so good to like be able to sleep in no cap Ooh. <laughs> felt good to be able to sleep in um <laughs> so i really enjoyed that and then i just made breakfast i had like a bacon egg and cheese with spinach and then afterwards i was like just a tad bit more hungry so i ate another bagel which i'm glad that i did though because i'm gonna have a really long day so i don't want to be like starving but you know because on tuesday like it wasn't too bad to be completely honest like I did have a snack. I don't even know what I'm going to pack today, but I was definitely a bit hungry, not going to lie. By the time after I finished my first class, but I also need to like make sure I'm hydrating as well. Um, but yeah, so it wasn't too bad, but yeah, I might, I don't know. So I, don't even, I packed a beef jerky. I might pack a protein bar this time. And then I might pack some carrots. That's so random. <laughs> but I feel like now that I'm kind of getting the swing of things, when I go grocery shopping, I'll know like what I want or like what I need. Cause I still might buy like a sandwich or like a salad from Trader Joe's. Those are like my favorite things um, to pack. Because I mean, it's realistic, like obviously pre-made and then <sighs> It's decently affordable. It's like, I don't think I paid more than $5 for like a salad or a wrap from Trader Joe's or a sandwich. Um, and then also too, it's a really good lunch that's filling. So yeah, I might do that. But I'm getting ready for the day. I'm so tired. <sighs> but my last day of class for the week. The only thing I like about having my classes on Tuesdays and Thursdays is like, I just have two days of classes and I'm done. Just gotta push through. Um, so yeah. But next week we'll start when I have my 9 a.m., which I'm not excited about at all, to be honest. <sighs> because. I don't know. I'm gonna have to wake up earlier. Oh, I thought about that. I'm gonna have to wake up earlier, Dan. I'm gonna have to wake up earlier. Because if it starts at 9 a.m., I'll have to be up like definitely like, four, four, seven. Oh. What am I doing? I have these like hydrating facial oil thingy. I'm just like putting a few drops in my um, moisturizer. And then just using that. But yeah, I was watching Make It or Break It. And I just like low-key just want to stay home. Like I just want to stay home. Uh, I hate, only thing I hate about having like virtual remote class because I have two is that like, it's like in the middle. It's not like, oh, like I start my day off with virtual, then I go in person. Or like I end all, it's just like, in person, virtual, in person, virtual. I don't like that personally because I feel like it's just annoying. Like I would much rather just like either be in my bed or be in the classroom. That's just my personal opinion. But I do like the flexibility of virtual. Like I could just be eating and like it really is chill. But I don't know. It just doesn't mean to my brain. Like if I'm taking a class that is not an actual classroom. It just feels weird. Um, okay, and then so this is Rose Glow and Get It Glow. What grows glow and get it? Cooling and brightening eye balm. 
not gonna lie, I think this, I mean, it isn't, it's not too bad for like my skin, but I definitely feel like it's a little bit more like blatant, like it's a little more glowy. Yeah. And then, okay, and then let me quickly do my brows, which I don't really do much because I don't know how to do much. So, yeah, pretty much, I want to buy another one of these, but for now, I just don't feel like spending money anymore. And plus to my method now, I think it still is fine for me. So I'm not pressed to buy a new one until it runs out. So I just like use this one to like brush it up because I feel like this one's more sturdy. And then this is just the e.l.f instant lift brow pencil thingy and then i pretty much just use this to fill it in but i like raise my eyebrows up a bit to kind of help out the shape i don't really care about having like super defined brows just to like make it look like something's there like i guess my goal is just to make it look like a natural brow like because i don't really have much so that's pretty much my goal. Why is my belly grumbling? The little jit just ate. Like, just ate. Okay, and that's that. I and mean, I'm thinking I'm ready for the day. So, happy Thursday. <laughs> yes, I'm back at home and like legitimately I'm upset. Like, Two minutes after I stepped outside, the humidity did me wrong. Humidity did me wrong. I was like, oh, I have a nice braid out, it's looking cute. And the humidity say, psych. But it's okay, like I'm really learning to just be confident in my natural hair, like, it's really not that deep. Um, I'm just wearing this t-shirt, so I'm gonna keep this on and just put some shorts on. Um, and then I got Chick-fil-A, cause like honestly, I was just, Oh, well, crazy. I was just really tired. I didn't really expect the four classes to like drain so much out of me, but it did. So going forward, I'm gonna have to start bringing an actual lunch. Like last night, I would like bring a sandwich and stuff. So I might start bringing like some pre-made Trader Joe's salads slash wraps or sandwiches and then bring them for lunch. And then also bring like a snack or two because today I actually forgot to bring snacks. I only <laughs> brought like a popcorn that I had from like a few days ago. Um, so I had to buy it. I ended up buying like what? Doritos, which I didn't finish. It was like stale. And I bought Cheetos and Skittles for my last class. And then I'm at Chick-fil-A and I'm gonna enjoy it. And I'm gonna finish my show because I was, I left them at a really good part. Um, and I was like, I just did not want to leave, but I had to. Stanley Doop is Chick fil A. And then I'm gonna go ahead and play Make It or Break It. Like, it just brings me back so many years. And I'm just like, I don't know, I love the show. I love this show. Season three, last season. I, I went by the show so fast. It's so sad. Okay, good morning, you guys. It is currently Friday, and I already started my day. I woke up early and then did my morning shift at Provello and then I rode and then I came back did a mini workout and then now I'm back in my apartment <laughs> but it's currently 10 45 I'm making breakfast really quickly um but I have my internship today from 12 to 2 o'clock so I was kind of getting my life together beforehand I really need to clean my room and I also put in a load of whites to get washed so very productive morning now i'm making breakfast my bacon's like low-key burning <sighs> but good morning this is real life so don't judge but i finished my breakfast i forgot a fork but bagel just put some light butter on it bacon eggs and my mint tea and i'm eating it on the floor because I don't want to eat in my bed but also i feel like eating on the floor is very comforting and then i have my tv right over here so i like eating on the floor in real life i'm gonna put that all the way but i'm gonna eat and then yeah ironically 
both of my packages came so we're gonna open up this one first this is easier so um it's my glasses so i ordered one online from i buy direct and then i got one at my eye doctor so my mom waited till my glasses were ready at the eye doctor to ship everything to me because i wasn't able to bring everything back with me when i moved back because i were packed and i bought so much more clothes than i came with Oof. so let's open up these glasses that's what it looks like And then I'm gonna open up the package my mom sent. I don't even have any scissors around. Girl, we crew. I'm not trying to tear the box up. This it. That's it. Okay. Now this one was also like a bold choice. That's what it looks like. I think I just took the L this year. Like, I don't know. Why do I look like like an alien? Oh, so, it just it feels so weird. <laughs> but now I am gonna go ahead and feel so weird with these. I feel like I can't. I don't know. Maybe it's like I don't know because I can't see my eyes. I don't know what. I don't know what the vibe is. I feel like in here is a better look at the glasses. So I can actually see my face and my eyes. Now I'm going to go ahead and put my clothes away, make my bed, because I have my, um, what time is it, 11.36. And then by 12 o'clock, I'm going to make sure that I text my manager, just kind of let her know what I'm planning on doing for today, especially because uh, they don't really have like a lot of tasks for me yet. So just kind of letting her know, like, hey, I'm gonna try to get access to the orientation materials or like the orientation recording from yesterday because I wasn't able to attend because I had class. And then I also, um, there's also some things that I've been like tagged in on Asana um, to just take a look at. So I also wanna take a look at that just to kind of keep me up to date. Hey guys, I feel like I'm trying to get used to how I look with this, but I just finished tidying up my room now and then I am gonna write a quick email to my manager and then hop in the shower real quick before I have to officially start work although i'm not probably gonna be doing much but yeah i'm just doing this quick outfit for like a little work at home ot look a little crazy whatever but now i'm gonna get to work and just catch up on a lot of different stuff that i need to catch up on okay you guys i'm pretty much done for the work day so i'm gonna get ready to head out now i just want a calm fit like just this basic black top basic cropped black hoodie these new jeans that I got from American Eagle. It's my first time actually like wearing it out, I'm pretty sure. And then just doing my ax slippers. We love them everywhere but the bag. And then I am wearing my new glasses out. I just don't like how like the reflection, you can't even see my eyes. But I didn't get food, my friends. And yeah. <laughs> okay guys, so I am back from eating lunch, dinner. It was just a weird time. <laughs> I think I'm gonna consider it my Mm, I don't even know because if I consider it my lunch, it means I need to eat dinner, which means I need to make dinner, which I have what I need to make dinner, but I don't really want to make dinner. <laughs> but if I call my dinner, <laughs> let me stop. But I know I'm going to get hungry. Like the portions were like kind of small. I went to like alpaca or whatever. It was a Peruvian restaurant. So it was basically... It was basically just like chicken, rice, and fries. That's what I got, and it was pretty good. <sighs> it was just good hanging out with my friends. I feel like, I don't know, just like hanging out with my friends. I feel like it's always just the grounding. Because it's my first time seeing both Naughty and Tanai. If you are a loyal subscriber, like from like last year, you would know who they are. Um, so yeah, so it was really fun and just nice chatting with them. Now I'm gonna go and read my Bible because I have not opened her up to this entire week. So 
how's it Friday already? Like this week just goes by so fast. I need to know how. But we're gonna go ahead and do that. Um, and honestly, for the rest of the day, I'm probably just gonna chill my bed. So I think I'm just gonna end the video here. I'm still trying to get used to like this type of glasses. But I think I do like it, but I just need to get used to it. But probably my next vlog probably won't see me in it. But I hope you guys enjoy this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next one.